Hello everyone and welcome to Blind Beauty. I'm Jennifer. What we're going to do today is I'm going to show you a way to do like a countdown to Christmas box. Now what I have here that I'm using, you can find these right now at the Dollar Tree, but any type of tin or anything like that will work for this. This is a little mailbox type thing. Cute, huh? Has the little mailbox that opens, has the flag that comes up, and on it it says, let it snow. Now, and then on the back of it, it says festive cheer, and it says it on the front as well. Has some little snowmen on it. You know, I got this from the Dollar Tree, like I said. And that's going to be it. Now, uh, what I'm probably going to do with this later, and I can do another video about this if you'd like, is I'm going to take this thing here and make it into like a positivity box, where it's an inspiring type box, where every day I can pull something out of here that says, you got this, or some other positive quote to help keep me inspired for the coming year. So, let me know in the comments down below if you want me to show you how I do that and transform this Christmas mailbox into an everyday mailbox type thing. But, let's jump on in here and get started here. Now, you could do any number of things. You could do makeup. You could do... Uh, some other type of whatever you want to put in there really but I'm using candy now I have several here that I've already done so I'm going to show you those here well a couple of them at least and all I did with these is I just took them and wrapped a bow around them you know wrapped a piece of ribbon around it so and I did several of these because I had planned on doing this like as an advent advent mailbox type thing. But, unfortunately, I didn't get around to doing that. So, I'm going to just show you as like a countdown to Christmas. Now, you can also do this for a countdown to birthday. You could do a countdown to whatever and have like the one that's in the very back of it be the big prize. Now, I'm taking this wrapping paper here. I just basically folded it in half. This is about the size that I was using before. You know, you can use any scrap wrapping paper you have. Just take it like this. Take you some candy. Now, the candies that I chose for mine, so that it's not all the same, I have some Smarties here. And like I said, this is, you know, this one that I'm doing here is going to be my big prize at the bottom of the thing. So on Christmas Day, this is what I'll open. I have some Reasons. And then I have some Hershey's Kisses and Werther's as well. Little Hershey's Kisses holiday ones. I mean, hey, who doesn't love a good holiday snack or whatever, right? <laughs> so, um, but, you know, I'm just putting a couple items in this thing here. And then I'm going to take it and in this situation where I'm at now, I put my candy in there. I'm going to fold the end in on each side. And then I'm just going to roll it like I would a burrito. Basically. And as I do a roll, I fold it in again. And just do that one more time. Let's see. I mean, it's that simple, y'all. Then you just take this, and just so that it's in there good, I'm going to take it and really wedge it in the back of this box. Right like that. Right like that. I mean, that way I don't accidentally on purpose grab it out before I get the others. And then, like I said, I... Now, on these others, I did wrap... Uh, ribbon around some of them. You know, some of them you can use tape. The ribbon actually came off on some of them. But we only have a few days until Christmas now, so I'm just taking them and stacking them right in here. Like I said, you can use any kind of Christmas uh, wrapping paper, birthday paper, tissue paper, any kind of paper. I mean, it doesn't matter. You know, 
take that and just fill this sucker up. And if you wanted to do like a, I don't know, 10 days of Christmas or whatever next year, then you got this in your arsenal to do. I mean, and it doesn't have to be perfect, y'all. They can, you know, go in there kind of messy. That way you got one right there that as soon as you open the door, here's the box and it's rather heavy. I can put it up here in my beauty area or whatever. Put the flag up to remind me, hey, 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 get me. Then once I do it, put the flag right back down. Then at night, before I go to bed, pull the flag back up. That way I know, hey, I got candy, I got candy. <laughs> so, let me know what you think about these little DIYs. I've got a couple more DIYs that I'm planning. So, you know, who knows what y'all might see. I'm thinking of some kind of makeup organizer thing. I'm thinking a brush holder, that type of things as well. So... You know, I'm doing quite a bit of filming today. That's why you've probably seen this look before. But, you know, still, I hope that you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments what you think and what you would like to see. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe so that you can see my future videos. And I will see you next time. Thank you and have a great day. Bye-bye.